like y suscríbete para que este animalito siempre tenga una flor para abrazar. Hey tú, ¿quieres ganar pavos mientras te diviertes? Pues estaré sorteando 40.000 pavos. Habrán cuatro ganadores. Para participar solo debes activar la campanita, suscribirte, dar like y comentar en el video. También daré mil pavos todos los días y revelaré al ganador al final de cada video. Lee la descripción para más información. Suerte a todos y gracias por apoyarme tanto. Moya, how did I not hit that shot? I've been robbed. He can't get up the hill. Oh, we hit those, oh. baby. Poor fellow. Oh, oh my, my legs up! We hit, dude. That was a flick. I can impulse this. I can impulse this again. Okay. Wait, wait go, go ahead. We can just wait for a moment. I got a kill. I got a kill. Nice. Right. Got right here. Got, got right, right here. here. I, yep. All right, we're impulsing. We're impulsing. Yeah, yeah. Okay, set it up. Someone set it up. I don't have it. I don't have anything. No. We don't. Yeah, yeah, get over here. Get on my go, side. All right, go, go, go. Just go, just go. I'm good, I'm good. Got another one. We're on me, on me. Oh, what the fuck? Come on, boys. We're, we're almost with you. We're, we're turning okay, up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get with me, get with me. Just watch our head, bro. We're getting minigun hard. Yeah, we're second. Where, where are you? Where are you? Okay, we're, we're together. Drop reverse. Down. Do you have any minis for me? Oh my god. Or bandages, I mean. Oh, actually, I'm good. I'm good. Okay, okay. We're gonna have to drop I saw 400 mats. You need any? I dropped down. Right here. Get him. Dead. Yes. Dead. Let's no, see. Get him. Minigun, no minigun. Watch out. No, we sorry, Zay. We love you. We love you, Zay. Do you want to use slacks? Slacks in the view. Okay. I'm going down. I'm going down. Both of us watch out. Drop down again. Yeah, I dropped. Holy crap. Come on, boys. I'm all the way low. There's a guy on low with me. Oh, they're spraying oh. hard, bro. Oh, man. That's going to be hard. Fuck. With them on height. There you go. There you go. There you go. Watch out on me. Got him. Got one on me. Yes, it's a big one. He's weak. Got him. 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 I'm shaking! Look at my hand! I'm shaking! Ah! Oh my god! Holy god! I'm sorry, mom. I'm screaming, but oh my god! It's so laggy, bro. My brain doesn't work when I'm freezing everywhere, dude. All right, edit, 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 edit. Oh wait, wait. Drop. He's trying to drop. In my box, in my box. <laughs> oh. 
Oh no. <laughs> the symphony emo. <laughs> Trio sitting in this game. And Clips they fell, and that was it. So it Sizz is down. Chap is down. Up to down, the so Liquid Vivid. Vivid. Being the last remaining winner to try and repeat. Stuck in the trees. Knocked down again. Out of mats. What play can be made? Into the Pump. bubble shield. Tyler's. Pump. Down, he finds another one. Back to back. Into Doesn't the bubble shield. Needs to be able to get the knocks. One conversion. Oh, huge. Mats. No mats. Seven builds. Ten builds. Right Turns back. Bubble Someone call me his builds. Oh! Finds a third. Vivid pushes himself into the top ten. He only gets five of the mats, though. Split off. 17 players left. Oh! Destroy! The siphon, being the difference. 30 HP, 20 tick. That's my bald friend. I feel like when you're playing in right. No mats, no problem, baby. I cannot believe it. They're adding bots to the game bro okay hold on dude what the f they're adding literal bots to the game nah homie in the next season we are adding bots to fortnite they will behave similarly to normal players and will help provide a better path for players to grow in skill what the f we're excited to get this out for everyone <laughs> I'm excited to play pubs. Oh my god. Oh. That's crazy, crazy, bro. That's crazy. Nah, chat, I do think that's a really good update for actual bots. Like, I think, uh, I think, like, people, like, well, like, like, Brooke, I think, will enjoy the game a lot more if it's like that. Like, with the skill match matchmaking and the bots. But like, dude, what the f are like, what am I supposed to do? It's really, I don't play arena for a reason. It's going to be even more boring. It makes it really boring for decent and good players, but I feel like the bots have a lot of fun. So, I don't know. They had bots in the game when the game first was out. I'm almost confident, like very confident that there were actual bots when the game definitely ran into some that would literally, they were like programmed to just run to the center of the circle. And they would just kind of stand there. Bro, I don't know what the, I don't know how I feel about this. I mean, I, I, but, I feel like it's very necessary for the game to like continue, but most people are going to hate it in terms of like the hardcore player base. But like, if you're a new player coming into this game, you can't wait. Someone goes, no, that's not true. Similar brutal action on the side as we have sent it. Edgy Amorex posted up 127 damage above and right now just trying to play gatekeeper with it. Looking out towards the storm, not allowing these players to rotate, opting to swap over to the rifles because they saw the tags. Andrew gets knocked down. I like that exclamation. I like and subscribe to your face. All right, here we go. They have the one elimination, so that's, that knock is going to give them two more points. They are sitting at a comfortable 35. But that does not mean they are going to slow down. Where is the last player? He's trying to keep the, the players alive. It looks like he will also go down. That is down. both of them cleaned up. In your bottom right-hand corner, the current leaders, 37 points. Scented, edgy, Rex sitting on the retail row loot. 847 light ammunition. When do they go up? How do they go up and who challenges them? That is the question. Typically, it's zone six. Zone five is just now closing and they've got Pryo. Do they shockwave up? Do they 90 up? Do they wait and go late? These are the questions. This is the best trio in the West. Eight tournament wins. How do they execute on this? And can they close the game out when they have everything they need? But the current high ground position. Yeah, if they can get that, they're literally, I'm telling you, uh, Mace Bugga, whichever one of the three he is, is going to sit on the high ground and rain shells from above. It is, they're just going to not see anything oh. except light ammunition. And they are going for this rotation on the safe side. But look at everyone else in the sky. There's so many people right now sundown. He finds himself a little nook. Going and up. this is it. He's challenging for the high ground. They know they have to get this, and they need to get it right now. They need to dictate the pace of everyone else in the lobby. People are starting to drop like flies. Persecute goes down. Don't forget, at top 12, he's sitting for the first round of placing points. We watched the new safe zone. We're getting dangerously close to low grab 
Here we go. They go up for the shockwave. They drop a bunch of people. Bunga eats a ton of damage. Drop down to 60 effective HP. He's going to shockwave back to reconnect with the team. Very close to edge here. But this is, you have the splashes as well to keep themselves topped off. But again, like you said, they need to keep challenging high ground. That is what they want. That's what they need. Great shot going to go out. I believe he must have caught himself up there. Looks like they just reconnect. It's okay. Tarping out as a group. Everything's okay. So now they're still just, they're joined at the hip, and that's what they need to be doing. 14 trios remaining. He did go up there. We're looking for it, but there's still another trio on the other side. A couple players are getting sent all over the place. Great snipe. Looking back on the backside, you need to stay ramped out or they'll take advantage of it. Now he goes. It's the seven circle high ground retake. He's going to look to reconnect with Bugga right there on the side. Excuse me, with Edgy right there on the side. Trying to push for it. Catches the Rockets. And now high ground is there. I just wanted to touch on that survivability aspect. Your monitors were not broken there. That blue filter was just these guys in zone for that long. We've seen patterns in late game two. Everyone likes playing so passive, they sit on the edge of the circle. They eat four. Maximal takes a big hit on his own body. He's gonna be healing up. We'll see and tune in if he finds and stays alive in the late game. Now we see Mazer Mongo moving in towards another trio. Looks like there's another box fight on the edge. The different perspective of this fight has Shockwave. Once again, the cost of the fight. How much do you want to invest early and make sure you don't lose too much fight? There's already half the Shockwave's gone. Here we go, that Shockwave, like you said, half Shockwave's gone, but it did land a big hit there. An opportunity to take high ground, didn't quite capitalize, but the player is still down underneath, does get the drop, looking for the follow-through on the edit. It's down to basically a 1v1, finds Pizus, a 1v2, my apologies, but now it's a 1v1, finds the white damage, no shield, goes for the siphon, very high IQ play, play there. He has an opportunity to be more aggressive if he wants to, based on the fact that he knows he hit...